Welcome everyone. I'm here today with YouTube's own The Cinestalker. Hey. And we are somewhere very fantastic. Do you know where we are? I know where we're at now. I do know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Take two. Welcome everyone. I'm here today with YouTube's own The Cinestalker. Hey, hey. And do you know where we are? Yes, we're by John Wayne's airport. <laughs> Take three. Oh yeah. We are somewhere very fantastic. Where are we exactly? We're right by John Wayne Airport, not too far from it. But we are not here to take a flight. We are not no. here to even talk about the new Fangle Plains. No, no. We are here for a little tidbit of history. You could even say maybe even a darker piece of history. Yes, right, right in these walls, right in this, right in this building. A darker piece of history is right in here. Maybe we should stop talking about it and actually see if it still exists. Let's do it. I'm curious. You guys ready for this? Are you ready for this? I'm ready. You are. You ready for this? Yeah. Join us. Let's go. Shall you? So there's the airstrip at John Wayne Airport and we're actually looking through a window right now and if you pan in you can see we're actually inside of this building with a lot of history a lot of old warbird planes that's awesome look at that A lot of really crazy planes out here. Dude, nuts. Look at the size. Woo. Look at the size of this beast. <laughs> Holy wings, man. cow, that the Look wingspan that. on that thing. Gargantuan. Whoa, freaky. That is pretty wild. That's massive. I really can't get over the sheer magnitude and the size of this thing right here. Whoa! Oh. Holy cow, there's like a guy in. Oh, it's a mannequin. <laughs> a little startling. <laughs> it's kind of freaky. Uh, this motorcycle was actually formerly owned by the actor Steve McQueen. Now while there are a lot of very cool artifacts, a lot of cool planes and other vehicles out here, the one thing I wanted to show you is something that most people have never actually seen in real life, including me. I'm talking about this right here. This car was owned and driven by the one and only Adolf Hitler. That's insane. What's your first impression when you see this? Ah, it's crazy, like, kind of like mind-boggling, you know, like it's weird that Hitler was in this, you know, like it's nuts. This is an actual car, he was like right there, and he has a picture of it over there. Pretty nuts, pretty wild, like it's just kind of crazy, you know? Here's a photo of him in the actual vehicle, and there's a lot of things on the car that you can tell match up exactly, signifying that this is the actual vehicle itself like look at the tires here and look at this little panel that flips down here's that exact panel right there 1939 mercedes-benz model g4 oftener touring wagon is that how you pronounce that oftener so. oftener yeah it says here in outstanding original condition the G4 has only been restored as needed and features original upholstery on the front seats. It includes bulletproof windshield and side windows, folding front passenger seat to facilitate standing from greeting crowds, and pistol holders and compartments throughout. Wow. 
Oh yeah, that's where the gun holsters that's went. Trip, huh? Right there, yeah. So the oh. guns would have actually been like mm -hmm. shoved down in there. It's like the original upholstery, so it's like kind of cracked with a the leather. Yeah. And there it is, original. This is bulletproof glass. So if you were to shoot into this and your hand was on this side, your hand or your face or your body would be safe. Yes. If you were to shoot through there. It feels like real thick too. The question I want to know, is that where the gas tank was? Did you put the gas into there? Oh, it looks like it is, huh? Maybe yeah, the I gas think. was there. And then there's like some sort of like a foot rest here. Yeah, you get Maybe up, you huh? like put your foot there to Look climb up into this the car. It's definitely like a foot thing too, probably. Like it's on that grip tank, that grip on there, you know? Yeah, this, very interesting. very interesting to actually witness and see history things of the past things that are not always good some things are a little bit evil a little bit bad people have different opinions on different subjects and that's not really what this video is about this video basically is about documenting pieces of history pretty crazy stuff that we saw down there thanks for watching thanks to the Cine stalker for tagging along oh, yeah, check yeah. out his channel YouTube slash Cine stalker is it the Sinistalker? It's a Sinistalker. We called them. It's a Sinistalker. Yeah. Just just look it up. You'll find it. You guys will figure it out. Thanks for joining us today at this very weird piece of history. See you guys later.